Omora, this is John with Opals. I thought I'd send a short clip on Lexile levels for you. <clears throat> I'm doing a search on science. And let me show you what will come up for you. When the there we are. When they when the hits come up, you'll see that those that have a Lexile will show it right in the brief record here. Different Lexile measurements. Um, and here's more. If you had other reading levels, they could be turned on as well here. But if you're only using Lexile, I usually advise just leave Lexile. It makes it too busy to have additional reading levels. All right. And then on the <clears throat> far left, the refined search. So I did a search on science, and it shows me different authors, formats that the library has, subject headings, um, let's say science and adventure and adventurers, or with your different prefixes, Dewey numbers, science in the 150, sensory perception, etc., during eras. And then farther down, we will see the Lexile measures. So if I just click the more, I can pull up, um, oh, in the 590s, there's six. Let's see what they have here. And there's your Lexile measures for those six books. Then, as far as doing a search for a reading level, search, reading levels, Lexis, or Lexile measure is, is there. I'm going to do a search on history. And um, I'm going to do a Lexile measure of 1,000 to 1,200. Oops, sorry. And let's do a search. Oops, I didn't put in science. Well, we'll get all the 1,000s to 1,200 right here. So there's an 1,100, 1,100, okay? 10, 10, 1,150 reading level. Let's do, oh, yeah, there's history. I guess I did do it. Yeah, sorry, I didn't see the word history. Sorry. <laughs> Okay, uh, so there's another way of searching your Lexiles, uh, either by title, by his, by keyword, or authors, and you can use the Lexile values like this, or just put in the uh, Lexile ranges over here. Okay, uh, so that's just a little bit on Lexile. I thought I'd send this short clip out.